rest of us are going to have to wait a little longer. So far, we don't have any additional showers or thunderstorms pulsing up for this evening. We are going to hold on to rain chances for about 9 o'clock today and then going into Thursday and Friday. Also looking at some more rain chances. 104 out there. That feels more like 108 out of our Sherman Chevrolet Cadillac Tower. Came a northeast wind about 6 miles per hour into this evening. Temperature is going to continue to drop into the upper 80s with that north wind lingering. We'll hold on to rain chances mainly confined to southeast Oklahoma and again heat continues to be uh, kind of one of the leading stories this week. Heat advisories again through tomorrow with excessive heat warnings out from Montague, Cook and Grayson counties. Now into the weekend these will likely be dropped but until then record breaking heat on the way both Thursday and Friday. The forecast highs both days are 104. Record highs range from 101 to 103 so we will likely surpass that both days. We're also watching these storms here tonight. So far, just this one severe storm there in McCurtain County. This was over Broken Bow Lake and has been drifting to the south and southeast at about 10 miles per hour and starting to see this core pulsing up again. This morning goes until 515. We'll wait and see if they extend this, but wind and hail the primary concerns with these storms that will likely stay along the Red River heading into tonight. All threats while low or not zero quarter size hail 60 mile per hour winds now through about nine o'clock with some locally heavy rainfall down and not really picking up on a lot of the activity going on in Oklahoma for this evening, but we'll continue to see some spotty activity along the Red River for the next few hours. Then into Thursday overnight into Friday morning, rain chances arriving to eastern Oklahoma. These could be severe in nature with a wind and a hail threat running through Friday morning. Again into Friday afternoon, more storms possible and Friday evening just in time for your high school football plans. Data also coming in with some scattered storms along the Red River there by 9 9, 10 o'clock. The weekend comes with low rain chances. Severe weather threats will be kind of moving around Texoma for the next three days along the Red River today into eastern Oklahoma there for your Thursday and then Friday staying in southeastern Oklahoma. Future rain, some could pick up a quick tent to a quarter of an inch of rain for the next few days, but it's next week that has our attention with over an inch of rain expected over a several day period. This comes as high pressure is going to be shifting off to the west. That opens the door for us to see some rain chances on the way here for the next uh, couple days for next week. Morning low is going to be in the 70s with afternoon temperatures in the triple digits and a look at that seven day sponsored by K&M Roofing and Construction highs in the 80s with a 40% chance for rain into next week guys. The 